Hi guys, Joseph the World here, and yet again, we are talking about another disgusting nonce. But not just any nonce, the disgusting man you see on your screen right now is Ryan White, who was talking to an actual nine-year-old until he got stung by a predator hunting group known as the Geordie Chasers. Ryan was communicating with an actual nine-year-old who he got increasingly more disturbing with as the conversation progressed. Later on, the father of the actual nine-year-old found out about um, the conversation and after Ryan sent a picture of his private area to the nine-year-old, he had enough and got in contact with a predator hunting group known as Johnny Chasers. And from as far as I can tell, they are pretty professional, at least in this non-sting. So props to them, because as we covered in these previous non-stings, at least when it comes to predator exposure, some of these predator hunting groups aren't the most professional and that can cost them later down the reload when these nonces do get caught after they've been arrested. When chatting with the nine-year-old, Ryan pretended to be a 15-year-old boy, and they obviously communicated on uh, Instagram. This guy was 22 and basically ruined his life. This 22-year-old um, started to ask the girl in the conversation to perform an intimate act on herself and told her that he had friends around her age that were having intercourse. What a dif disgusting man. This nuns also asked for explicit pictures and told her, and I quote, my privates say I love you. Now, the worst part of this conversation, which I'm not sure... I couldn't really clarify if this bit was when he was talking to the actual nine-year-old or if it was when he was communicating with the actual predator hunting group that took over. But there was a point in the conversation where he became so explicit, I need to try and be careful with my words here, that he became so explicit with his fucking sick desires that she was crying and begging him to stop. To the point where he said, either send me nudes or send a video of you doing something to yourself. That's all I'm going to say about that. And that has to be one of the most disgusting things I've ever heard in any of these non-stings. Or any of these things that I've covered. Now, I'm not going to show footage of the non-sting. Because the video is too long and... There's not really much to show a clip of anywhere. But what I will say is he shows little emotion when throughout the entire non-sting denying these uh, claims or allegations. And even when his mother finds out and says, we well, don't, don't ever get in contact with me. You're not welcome back in this house. You're getting kicked out and all this other stuff after you know it's been sorted out. He shows a little emotion. He barely even apologises. It's actually disgusting. But what actually happened to Ryan White? What happened to the uncaring nuns? Despite adamantly denying any wrongdoing, it, saying it wasn't him and stuff, he was obviously arrested, and then when he, he appeared in court, he pled guilty to all this stuff, and he has been locked up for 27 months after he admitted to attempting to incite a child under the age of 13 to engage in sexual activity and possessing indecent images of kids, because he was fa when his phone was seized, he was found with three images of some disgusting images of children. He was also ordered to a sexual harm prevention order for 10 years and was made to sign for the sex offenders register for 10 years as well.